Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel Middleware AI Academy. In today's video, I'll show you step by step how to install VMware Workstation and set up Red Hat Linux. So let's install it now. Double click on the VMware software which we downloaded earlier. Click on yes to proceed. If you are new here, make sure to check out my first video where I explain how to download VMware and Red Hat Linux ISO. The link is in the description below. So let's begin. Now check box to accept the agreement. Click next. Keep as it is and click on next. Uncheck in case you don't want product update on startup. Now again, click next. Again, click next. Let it install and let's fast forward to save some time. Yes, now finally it's done. Click on finish. Let's double click on VMware icon to start the application. Let's maximize the window. Now click on a create a new virtual machine. Select the recommended option that will be typical. Now again click next. Select radio button which says I will install operating system later. Click next. Now you have select Linux and from drop down select Red Hat Enterprise Linux 64 bit. Now click next. Give the name to your VM. RHEL9. Now browse the location where you want to install the binaries. Let's do it in D drive. Here you create a new folder. Name VMWware and select it properly. Let me give 60 GB disk space cause we will use it to install Apache Tomcat and WebLogic in coming videos. Keep it as it is in this radio button. Now click next. Now let me click on customize hardware. Here you have to uh, select RAM to 4 GB to speed up the installation and change CPU as per your hardware. Now I'm going to give it two core. Now click on close. After this click on finish. Now click on edit virtual machine settings. Here you have to select CD slash DVD. Now click on radio button. Use ISO image file. Here browse the image from downloaded folder. Now power on the virtual machine. Click up arrow to select install Red Hat Linux. Now select language English and on the other side English India. Click on continue. Now we have to update date and time. Here you have to select India. Now click done. Here you have to keep it as it is. Now we are going to do software selection. Select server with GUI. Now next come to installation destination, keep it automatic and now click on done. Here now we are going to create root password. I have created it, now confirm it. Checkbox allow root SSH access. Now create one user, create the username as per your choice. Set the password for it. Now click on done.
Network setting is all good. Now click on begin installation. I'm going to save some time of yours. Let's fast forward it. It usually takes 10 to 20 minutes based on your hardware configuration. Finally, it's done. So let me reboot the system. Let's log in with root user. Here. Uh, now open terminal. Maximize it for better visibility. Let's run few commands. If config to check IP address. Cat space slash etc slash OS release to see which version of Linux is installed. And here it's 9.6. It's all good. Let's me close it. Power of the machine. Yes. So we are done with the complete setup process. Thank you for watching the whole video. If you are still here, lots of thanks. Please don't forget to share and subscribe. And if you find this video really useful, please hit the like button as well. Thank you.